Same. All right. Anyway. All right. Y'all can see. Bruh. Off rip. They're maxing, bruh. Like on who off rip? All right. Shoes on, mister. Wait. Wait. Don't. Oh, geez. I'm cleaning it I'm here. I'm not. Bro, this is where shit went super left, man. Right? I'm sorry I just barged in like that to your personal space. I shouldn't have. That's so awkward. Like First of all, he should have just locked the door, bro. He's maxing. Isaiah, is it okay if I come in? Yeah. Yes, then. Come in. I mean, you already yeah. walked in the first time. You might as well just. Bro, this is so awkward. I didn't see anything. Listen, kiddo. What you were just doing, which I had no right to interrupt without knocking, and I'm sorry, but what you were doing was completely natural and normal and, and to be expected. And I just wanted to come in, not to make it weird, but He's literally sure making it weird. You weren't feeling strange. There's nothing to feel strange about. It's something that everybody does. And everyone's entitled to their... Do you do it? <sighs> well, everybody What does. kind of question is that? So you do do it then. I mean, it's common. <laughs> yeah. It's something that's natural to do for all people. And all people deserve to have their boundaries respected. And that's where I crossed the line. So I'm um, sorry if this is weird. Yeah, this is the day where I just to everything sure just went left, man. Again. Like like this was ugly. Imagine. And hide it under the rug and let it become something. Taboo. Do you think the situation would have been that bad if the dad didn't walk in? Actually, yeah, what am I talking about? Yeah, because he still would have had the thing in his hand. Yeah. You know what taboo is? Yes. Well, now it won't be, because we talked about it, and it's out in the open. Okay. I am sorry if this is weird. This is not. Oh, good. It shouldn't be. Why does he keep looking well, down? Well, I'll leave you to it then. Dad. I love you. I love you back. What the fuck, bro? Like, bro, what? If we could try mom's hands on the big man's shoulder. All right. Oh, that's just lovely. And if we could all just look straight ahead, please. Oh, wonderful. And we're a happy little family with a great big smile. Fantastic. Like what, bro? Just How look at this. this was I not smiling? Oh, were you? Uh, oh, sorry. I thought I was. Then let's, uh, let's just have another big one. I would be so creeped out, bro. There we go. Love it. <laughs> okay, looking good. And now if I could just get a big smile from the two happy families. Family. 14 Sorry. years later. Today we're one happy family. <laughs> Got a little crowded all of a sudden. That's the way I like it. <laughs> you see my cufflinks? Yeah, we can see those, no problem. You think? Because I could turn more toward the camera. <laughs> Thanks for everything, Bobby. <laughs> Do we all say cheese? You can say cheese, you can say taco, you can say whatever. Oh you my like. god, this is just this bruh. Weeniest little I just feel so bad because like bro, what the fuck do you even I'm calling the police, bruh. No. Why did he allow it to get this far? 
<laughs> now, where did you get that tuxedo from? Because, I mean, you know, any dude that wears a tuxedo like that is gonna break some hearts. Uh, he ain't gonna break some hearts. What do you think happened to me? <laughs> Have you seen where they went, by the way? Well, Mary Ann was over there. We were just talking. I think I met Isaiah. Oh, I, I don't know. I haven't seen him. I think I may go find him. Okay, okay then. See you I later. Think you have to keep yeah. Alrighty. Hi. Did you like that cake? Oh, I love it. I'm glad. Have another piece. Okay. So good to I'll see you. I'll talk to you later. Okay. All right. Come on. Are you finished? I just don't understand. No, I haven't. All right. See you in a minute. Hi, you. You are such a little clown. Oh, shit. Hi, honey. Have you seen Isaiah? Uh, no. Uh, everyone having a good time? Can I get a hot water? Mama, beautiful reception. I will be right back. Hold on. And then Isaiah is just wilding, bro. Like, what are you doing? Bro, fuck no. She didn't call him out. Oh my god. He clearly needs help, bro. Like, she's just... Wow. And then she just goes back like nothing happened. Honey, would you go get your father? Dinner's up. And then she has the nerve to say, honey, go get your Shall father. Shall I help set the table? Oh, that's okay. Everything's under control. <laughs> This nigga is tripping, bro. I'm I'm tripping. I'm tripping. But it shouldn't have even gotten that far, bro. Like, you're wildin'. You're wildin'. You're the adult. For din dins. Nah, the dad is going through it, bro. Here we go. He's going through it. It's hot. Mmm. You want one of these? I'm okay. They're Belgian. I know. Thank you. I'm okay. You know, these aren't for me, Dad. I got them for you. I'll have one. Well, they're Dad's, so you're gonna have to ask him first. Pass the potatoes, please. Cute. Nah, it's the mom that pisses me off, bro. Like, the, this, the whole... It's like everybody just pisses me off. The dad is not speaking up. Would you like one? 
Oh, maybe later. The mom seen the shit that happened. Thank you, honey. Oh my god. Thank you. Biscuits? Sure. Like this is your dad. Like what the fuck? I mean, I don't know why he's he's writing this letter 14 years late, bro. Hey, you're here. I, I forgot that toilet Look was broken. I'm just gonna use bro. yours. No, that's my. Wait a minute. You, you, your mother's in there. I can wait. I feel so bad for him, bro. It's wraps. There's no way he's not finding it. Like, bro, what did you do to get in this situation, bro? This is that's the thing that's just blowing my mind. so scared. I tell you, Dad, from a poet, I expect more eloquence. I'm sorry. What for? Hmm? I'm just shocked. For nothing? For what I wrote. What you wrote? You mean your little autobiography? All 300 pages of it? And then this nigga has the nerve to be upset. Are you serious, bro? I love you, Dad. But this makes it hard. <sighs> and I'm burning this. And if I see another copy lying around, it's gonna be more than a slap on the wrist. I promise you. This is his dad that he's talking to, bro. What the fuck? Like... What I don't understand is like, is your wife not enough, bro? And even if your wife isn't enough, why don't you find somebody that's like interested in that shit? You gonna hold your dad hostage? He's like, he's maxing, he's maxing. Like, bro, just kill me, bro. Just kill me.
Oh my god, I feel I don't made it too. I just feel so bad, man. Thank you so much for coming. I just feel so bad. Next Tuesday. Next Tuesday. We know you happy new year. You know? I think I'm just gonna help and stay here. The fuck was that for? You're gonna what? Just to help clean. I mean, this is such a mess we're leaving them with. It's gonna be okay. I'm just gonna come home a little bit later, okay? That's all. A person who wakes up in the morning and says today's gonna be awful, I just know it. Well, that person is just about guaranteed to have an awful day. In Damn. fact, he'll do the legwork to make it awful. Through the power of his attitude, he'll prevent every potentially good thing on his path from reaching its potential. And if the right. things do happen, well, he'll be looking in the other direction. Because what he's done is he's committed himself to the prison of negativity. Now, on the other side of this coin, a person who wakes up and greets the day with enthusiasm and positivity will see the good things on his path. Because through the power of he Dad? Oh, shit. How do I feel about locked doors? Bro, no. Yeah, it's raps. It's raps. Like, she's not calling the police? Like, what is wrong with this lady, bro? And then the thing is, when... Oh, God, bro. They just keep allowing this shit to happen. What the fuck, nigga? What that in your book? Then this nigga has to sleep next to his wife. And he knows she knows. <laughs> Bro, this is crazy. Another book of yours? Are you asking me to get upset? I'm not asking you anything. Why the fuck is well, he still I'm at the house, you. bro? He's supposed to be like what I'm just leaving. This is pathetic, Dad. If you want me to apologize, I'll apologize. And I am sorry about what happened last night. And I did go too far. But what about you? Am I totally alone here? Yes. You're this abusive monster and you're some sad, helpless victim? Yes. Or does it take two to tango? Because I think it does. And if I've done anything, you've done it with me. Don't check your fucking head at me! Everything I've ever done has been for you, and for you, and for you, and to what end? I didn't ask for this. This is your thing, something you started. But I'm here now, and I'm in it, and I've given myself, and I've accepted you completely. But you are not just my father. You're my friend. You're my best friend. And maybe we can just agree that that's a beautiful thing, and not something to be perverted and corrupted and mutilated by your warped and confused conscience. Confused conscience? He's sick. 
You've always sabotaged everything good in your life. You've been shitting all over this from the minute we started. You never gave it a chance to be good. But you can sleep with that cold bitch in that loveless bed. Nigga, your you your, your mother? About your backwards son. This nigga said that cold bitch like it's not his mom, bro. He's wildin'. Or my camera died, bro, Jeff. But he is tweaking. He's acting like if his dad didn't sleep with her, he wouldn't be alive right now. Like, nigga, what the fuck are you talking about right now? Nah, I feel bad for the dad, bro. But at some point, you gotta like, just can't let this, just cannot let this shit slide. Cannot let this shit slide. Son, but not a single word about what you've done. It's just love, dad. And that is big. And that is scary. But there's being scared, and there's being a coward. And right now, you're, you're breaking my heart. Just leave, bro. Just leave. I ain't gonna lie, that's probably the best thing that can happen in this situation. Cause he wasn't gonna help himself. The wife wasn't gonna help him. Here, this bitch girl. But the thing that fries me, she has the nerve to cry, as if she couldn't just. Like, she has no right to be upset right now, bro. She allowed this shit to continue. She saw his face. She heard him screaming, bro. She didn't help this nigga at all. What the fuck? Bro, you gotta chill. You gotta chill, bro. You gotta chill. I want to ask you something, Isaiah. How long have you been standing there? How are you holding up? Why was your father crying when he drove you home from prom night? Prom night? It started at prom night? On your prom night, when he brought you back home. What about it? He was crying. Was he? He was crying, and he wouldn't look at me. Are you being serious? He locked himself in the bathroom, and he just cried. Bruh, and he this cried situation is just so fucked. I don't even know who's wrong. I don't remember that at all. Because, like, I don't know who's more at fault. Is that when it started? That was 10 years ago. How am I supposed to remember what happened one night? Prom night? Which was 10 years ago. That's a pretty long time to remember what your father did at a specific time on a specific night. It, it started earlier. I, I know that. When 
When did it start? Mom, you're emotional. I'm emotional. We are not Stop ourselves. It. You don't even know what you're trying to say. I know exactly what I am trying to say. Well, I don't. But I think it's pretty ugly what you seem to be saying, and I think you would agree if you could hear yourself. This nigga's a master manipulator. You monster. You killed your own father. How could you? What? Wait. Get off of me! I'm warning you, Mom. You don't warn me! <laughs> I loved him better than you ever did. What the fuck? You sick! Ow! Sick! Ow! Sick! Ow! <laughs> bro, so what's the plan here, bro? Somebody's going to jail regardless. Damn. <laughs> now she's going to jail. All of this could have been avoided. I don't even know when the fuck it could have been avoided, bro. I don't know. The situation is just too far gone, but I don't even know who's more wrong between the mom, dad, and the son, bro. This not nah, the son is wild. The son is wild. After the bathroom locked door shit, he's tripping. Yeah, he's tripping. But bro, she gonna turn up the volume while he's calling for help, bro. That's crazy. Oh. Oh, my fault, my fault. We didn't get this turn is called the thing in the apartment, bro. Leave a like, subscribe, comment for another one. We'll see you next man. Um This is the second scary video. Yeah, I'm about to just leave these two. I'm not even about to add one more because the first one was already insane. What? In my apartment, there's something in there. What's in there? Something. It just walked into my room. What? Like, like an animal? No, I don't know. Lindsay, calm down. Where are you? I, I don't know. Yo, don't know. Lindsay's tweaking. I, I don't know how far. I was so scared. Okay. Bro, I'm know. getting just scared. Hold on. Figure out where you are. I'm gonna come get you. Oh my god, hold on. This one got potential. Nigga, this shit low-key. I'm on edge now, bro, because what the fuck? What the fuck? Lindsay, it's me. I can see you. It's all right. You can come out. Is she good? Jesus, Lindsay. <laughs> it's okay. Hey, it's all right. What happened? Something scared you. Oh my God, it was awful. Why didn't you call the police? Who was it? I... I didn't know if it would be in there if I even... I only saw it for a second. Saw what? 
Bro, I'm about to go to bed after this, and I'm actually kind of scared Just now. Start from the beginning. Okay. I was lying in my bed. Don't show flashbacks. I knew it. Why the I fuck did I know this was gonna show this shit, bro? Fuck. Waiting for my sleep. She couldn't just tell the story. They couldn't just tell the story. They gotta show it. After one, two weeks. I heard that. I'm scared. I'm like, I'm not even gonna lie. Yeah, he's right there. I just threw the door open and ran. I felt like it was right behind me, but I didn't look back. Bro. I just kept running. And then I called you. What kind of sleeping pill? It's prescription, some generic thing. I, I'm scared. I but... just started taking it yesterday, but this started before that. What did? This feeling like someone's looking at me at night. But Lindsay needs this to get a fucking sleep in the first place. I feel dog. Like it's just been in boyfriend, me. husband, something. But you can't be sleeping there by yourself. She's maxing. <sighs> but I'm scared. I keep I keep looking to the side because I'm thinking this tall. Okay. Do you want to go take a look? No, I don't no. want to go back there. Lindsay, if it's an animal, it probably just ran out. This that dumb shit I'm talking anyway, about. Anyway, she you just really told you. The door open all night. Let's just drive up the driveway and we'll see if we see anything. She just told you. I don't see anything. Obviously. Pepper spray. Just in case. Bruh. No, Sam, please don't go. Listen, if I'm Lindsay, Sam, you know what? You want to be the hero? That's fine. Take this flashlight. Here are the keys. You can go upstairs. I'm keeping my black ass in this car with the fucking car on, on the road at the end of the neighborhood. So if you do see him, it's either you run to the end of the neighborhood to catch me, or like you're on your own. Cause I literally told you, like, did you not see the detailed fucking flashback? Upstairs, Lindsay. You said it yourself. You don't even know what you saw. Yeah, maybe right. it's nothing. Can yeah, you please maybe just come nothing. back in the morning? I don't want to be here. I'm just gonna go take a look. Yeah, sure. If I see anything, I will come right back. I promise. We can go to my place, call the police, whatever. Okay. I don't know who the fuck she thinks she is. Sam. I know if it was the pills. Stay in the car. At least give her the keys, right? Like, who do you think you are? Who do you think you are, bro? Oh, she's gone. Bro, if I get too scared, I might have to turn this shit off, bro. I'm sorry. It's about to be 1 a.m. I got to be up at 6 to go to work, bro. No light. Just walking in there. No weapon. She think
Like, Lindsay being that scared is enough for me to just not even go in the house, bro. I'm scared. <gasps> bro, I'm not normally scared, but I'm scared, bro. I just don't know what to expect. What? Don't go, don't go. job just close the door please god just close the door please she's gone just close the door <laughs> oh my god no she's gone she's gone she's gone She's a goner. It's in the car. Just take me too, bro. You're already here. Just take it. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm so scared. I'm so scared, bro. I'm so scared. Yeah. <laughs> this bitch. This bitch, Sam. This bitch, Sam. Bro, there's more. Oh, so alternate ending? Yeah, fuck that, bro. I'm not, I don't give a fuck about none of that shit.